Awesome. Okay, so um, slightly hard again, um, but the, essentially this one is about a symmetry. Uh, so what we're trying to do is make this side symmetrical with that side. Now what the, we're missing here is this one is the same color and it should be a different color. And then we can click on this one to create that X again. Okay, so this one's uh, tricky and I can never remember how to play this one. So I'm just going to... Okay, yeah, that's it. So that's a Freer, and that motif comes back and again in, later on in this game. Um, this one's a fun level which I designed quite close to the end, and um, was more to do again with what I was doing in the step up um, level earlier on, where I'm basically telling you what to click on. So if you just try and forget the rules a little bit, and just kind of go, well, those ones look like they should be clicked, so let's click on them. So it does all the diagonals, and then you can see here that, it's, that we've got that one. So if we go back, we kind of go bump, bump, now we get gold. Da -da -da. So there's a certain amount of zoning out with this game as well, which I kind of intended. Um, again, this is a sort of similar sort of deal on this level. So we've got these two ones which are different colours, and it's it's almost pleading, like, oh, click me, those two. So let's do that, click there, there. And now we're left with that X again. Whew. Okay, we're getting to the end of the diamond levels now, so it's starting to step up a little bit. Um, this, these all here are kind of red herrings. Um, this is another um, level where it just asks you basically to use what it's telling you. Um, and again, on this level, except for instead of only showing you these two, which you could do it that way, um, but you can also do it in this way by climbing up like that as well. And again, in this level. There you go. Okay, so this one's quite tricky, um, much less like the other levels. Go back a bit um, where it's telling you where to click. It is kind of, but if you follow, then it won't work. So I want you to click on one of these, um, but specifically, you need to do this one, and then you're left with these two here. So dunk and then dunk. Okay, so. Uh, the new set of 15, so this is the new tile. Um, this is a octagon tile, and as you can hear, I'm trying to click on it, but you can't. It's somewhat like a stop sign um, in the UK, so the octagon shape um, doesn't click, it doesn't do anything, but you can still affect it with tiles next to it. So if I click on this tile, that will change now, but I can't specifically click on it itself. So Armed with that knowledge, now we can click on this one and change the one top and bottom of itself and get that gold. Okay, so now similarly you can do this one three. I'm going to kind of wash through them now. This one is one of those ones where I'm kind of showing you where to click. Um, what I like about this tile though is it opens up a new idea around the, the puzzle in this game where, um, for example, I can't click on these, and, the, and on this level, there's no way of interacting with them. So, what I'm showing you is make these blue. Like the end state has to be blue. So, before now, it's either colors to win, but now this level can only get, you can only get through this level if you make the same color as the octagons. Um, and this is a similar motif to what we got earlier with the uh, diamond shapes. Okay, in a similar way, um, you can't, oh you can affect that one, that's a lie, that's a lie. Um, but hopefully you would spot it that this one looks a little bit out of place, so let's click that. And then we could click this one, or this one, or this one, but these ones we can't click. Uh, and this one is a diagonal one, so let's click that. One. Great, okay, this one is one of those ones where it's telling you to click. And it's nice and symmetrical, symmetrical rotation, it's quite nice. Um, this one is asymmetrical and it is quite tricky, um, but essentially, um, I forget how to play this one. Okay, let's do that again. Donk, donk, okay. 
okay you see that so diagonal and then move the diagonal again and then what I'll do is I click on this one and there's only that one on the diagonal there so boom. <coughs> okay so this one looks confusing uh, but it's actually really really easy you use the square tiles and this one is actually replicated later on uh, in a slightly different way this one is super tricky and I can never know how to do it so I'm impressed with myself there um, you have to rewind if you want to see that okay boom um, this one's one of those ones where you should be able to kind of work it out even though it is um, all four moves so you can see that this one so these are the ones that you want to change because they are unchangeable so this one changes that one these two need to change but there's nothing to change them so I'll click those and now with the fourth move I finish it with the diagonal and this is um, like I said earlier this one that it's coming back to except for instead of having um, two octagons either side here we have these square tiles and instead of just being able to go like that like this we can't do that anymore so what we have to do is we can use these square tiles there you go and similarly here and so we have to end up with these octagons um, these all the tiles being yellow because we can't actually interact with these octagons at all okay boom 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 totally forgotten okay let's try that again boom and then again so it's a freer um, I like the look of this level it's one of my favorite looking levels um, slightly tricky but essentially you go up the ladder down again and again this is a slightly tricky looking level um, but you can do it in two like that quite sneakily you can actually win this one on gold with three moves as well which is you could do it in a different way uh, this one I'm going to do quickly so that you have to work that one out a little bit. Okay, so this is the last set 15 um, levels so far. So I'm looking to make new levels if enough people play the game and hopefully charge for those levels um, so that I can carry on making this game and other games. Um, but this last set of 15 levels um, introduces this circle tile. Um, so hopefully um, what you'll do is work out what the circle tile does in the circle tile. Um, spoilers um, does every tile around it, itself and itself so if I click this one it will change to yellow and these two will change to yellow and that one change to blue <coughs> so in so armed with that knowledge now we know that we can we need to change this one like so and now all of these in this area will change great and likewise here um, trick is that there's kind of like two levels bum, bum, bum. and it just gets more tricky I guess from here on in um, and like I said I've played these levels so, so many times um, and, and lots of times of play testing with different people watching people play um, that I am super adept at completing the levels the very last level I still find tricky however but um, that's fine actually in this level as well. Bam bam bam. Sometimes you just forget how to play. There you go. And uh, no, uh, no, no, no. Good one. Um, yes. Do I remember how to play this level? Yes. Eventually. Um, yeah, so some of them are much trickier than others as you go along. Um, and this circle ones really start um, introducing a lot of um, thought processes. Okay, good, thanks. Ooh. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, no. Wait, 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 wait. Duh. And then duh. Good. Um, so I'm working on a new game project at the moment um, and hopefully going to 
do some more games jams soon. Um, did global games jam this year, and um, looking to release uh, full color tiles on some more platforms as well. I've been looking at Kindle, um, as it's already on Android, and um, I've also got it available on Mac and PC and Linux uh, through itch.io. So check it out. Um, I'm speeding through these, so hopefully you can crack on with them yourself. Da, da. Uh, and again, let me know if you want new levels. And I will make them. Okay, so this is the very last level and pretty much the trickiest level in the whole game. Um, I can usually do it in four, um, which is how many you should be able to do it in, but um, who knows in this video? Under, under pressure, ding 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 ding. Um, there we go. Do it in 10. Okay, so that is uh, full color tiles. Hope you enjoy. Um, let me know how you, what you think about it and um, try and complete the last level in four or less. Okay, thank you. Bye.